What is going on everyone? This is Jacob Amaral here. At the end of each month, I go over in full transparency how my automated trading systems are doing. Are they losing money or are they making money? In today's video, we're gonna be going over March, 2022. Let's do this. We made a total profit of $1,040 uh, US dollars in net profit. We had a gross profit of 1,200, a gross loss of 213. Um, commissions do show zero, so we probably Put, you know, maybe we made 1,038 or 1,039. We had a profit factor of 5.87, sharp ratio of 0 0.6. Uh, we had a 50% win rate. We only made uh, two trades. I only had actually one system running with um, my swing trade system on SP 500 futures. I'm testing a lot of different strategies and not really comfortable running them live yet. But so, so March, we're only running actual one, one real system. And, and, you know, something I sort of forecasted, I thought, you know, we had to see a bounce around this time. And my, my bet was right this time. Um, so we, we made a, a solid profit on my, my swing trading S&P 500 uh, future strategy. It has a trail, a, a cool trail exit on it, where the trail stop only activates once we're up X percent. So um, it was able to capture quite a bit of profit you know, with one contract. So yeah, we only made two trades this month and made a thousand. Um, I know last video you guys wanted to see the actual trades, so uh, let me uh, pull them up. Uh, let's see, trades. Okay, so there's the trades that uh, happened. Um, and once again, I've said this in, in multiple videos, but you can see that they were actually performed on a live interactive broker's account. So if you're ever watching someone show their trades and you can't really either, you can't see their account number or they never really show it, um, you know, that, that's a red flag. You should be able to see their account number. Um, I probably shouldn't be sharing mine. Um, I'm probably going to blur out some of the numbers, but, um, anyways, that's something to, to keep in mind when you're watching other influencers, if you will. So we had a, um, the first trade was March 9th. We lost $200 on that. Um, I think, you know, we had an entry signal and obviously it was a, a fake out. And then we had a second trade, um, March 15th to uh, March 22nd. And we made uh, $1,200 on that trade for a total profit of a thousand. That was with one contract. So I wish I traded heavier on that trade, but you know, still not, still not really comfortable with, with doing that yet. Um, but overall awesome, um, de decent month, decent month for sure. N wasn't crazy like January or, or my biggest, my, my big loss in February, but it's, it's good to be back, um, or, or we're coming back if you will. Um, so yeah, not, not too many trades. I know you guys watch these videos and you want to see like a billion trades and, and all this data and stuff like that, but, uh, it doesn't always work that way. I wasn't comfortable running a lot of strategies. Um, I just wanted to run this one because my, my, my testing and my forecasting just is, I'm still kind of working on it and which wasn't comfortable with launching a bunch of strategies. So this one has done well for me. I'm going to keep doing it. Um, lessons learned from this month. Definitely. I missed a lot of opportunities, um, with some other strategies, especially oil and wheat. Um, but you know, um, we're working on adding those into the bunch as well. I'm looking at treasuries as well to pair with this strategy. Um, you know, going long treasuries and, and going long the SP 500 features at different times. It's a good, it's a good hedge essentially, because on average, if, if they're, they're pretty much pretty close to inversely correlated where if S and P 500 is going down, the treasury is going up and vice versa. So it's something I want to incorporate as well, but overall very happy with this. Um, you know, we're going to keep going. That's it. I'm going to keep making these videos, keep showing you how much I'm making or losing per month, being transparent about it, real about it. Um, and keep doing my thing. So, um, I hope you guys enjoy these videos, find value in them. Um, let me know in the comments below. Um, if these help you, if these inspire you, uh, that sort of stuff, because that, that makes me happy. So anyways, that's all guys. Uh, have a good week and we'll see you next one.